that I was taken by a young friend of mine to MGM on the off chance that they, they might consider me. Angela Lansbury is a British American actress and singer. Her full name is Angela Brigitte Lansbury, but is also known as Angie. She was born on October 16, 1925, in Regent's Park, London, England, making her 96 years old at the time of this production. She stands at 1.73 meters, or 5 feet 8 inches tall. Her favorite author is F. Scott Fitzgerald. Roseanne and Seinfeld are her favorite TV shows. Her favorite hobbies include reading and watching TV shows. With a career that stretches back to the so-called golden age of Hollywood, Lansbury is a living reminder of the rich history of filmmaking. She is the oldest living Academy Award nominee. All in all, Lansbury's career has spanned more than eight decades. Off screen, Lansbury has spoken throughout her life with an English accent. She holds an Irish citizenship. As a young actress, her hobbies included reading, horseback riding, playing tennis, cooking, and playing the piano. She also has a keen interest in gardening. In early life, Lansbury was a chain smoker. She gave up the addiction in the mid-1960s. In 1976 and 1987, she had cosmetic surgery on her neck to prevent it from broadening with age. In 1994, Lansbury was appointed Commander of the Order of the British Empire, CBE, and later promoted to Dame Commander of the Order of the British Empire, DBE, in the 2014 New Year's Honors for Services to Drama, Charitable Work, and Philanthropy at Windsor Castle. As of 2022, Angela holds the record for hosting the most Tony Awards shows. Angela has hosted five times. She is a staunch Democrat and a solid supporter of Barack Obama. It, it's difficult to say. When you're born with the kind of beauty that she had, which was universally praised as being absolutely it. Her mother was Belfast-born actress Moynya McGill. Her father was a wealthy English timber merchant and politician, Edgar Lansbury, a member of the Communist Party of Great Britain and former mayor of the Metropolitan Borough of Poplar. She has been friends with Beatrice Arthur, Bob Hope, and Lewis Hertham. Angela Lansbury's first husband was the late actor Richard Cromwell, whom she married at the age of 19. The 35-year-old Cromwell married Angela in 1945, but divorced her in 1946. Lansbury later discovered that Richard was actually gay. Her second husband was another actor named Peter Shaw, and they were wed in 1949. During their 54-year marriage, the couple had two children together. In 2003, Shaw passed away, in the 1960s, Angela discovered that her children had become addicted to drugs as teenagers. Although Angela and Peter started with marijuana, they were soon taking heroin and cocaine. Lansbury even admitted that her daughter Deidre was connected to the followers of Charles Manson. In an effort to set her children straight, Angela relocated the entire family to County Cork in Ireland. In the end, both of her kids became clean. Lansbury later blamed herself for her kids' drug issues saying that she had become too focused on her entertainment career and not enough on her family life. It's very hard to live with that kind of scrutiny on the part of the public and her marriages and her children. Lansbury first gained acting work alongside her mother, earning $60 a week singing songs at nightclubs at the age of 16. Angela was cast in the film alongside Ingrid Bergman as a cocky maid at the age of 17 and she earned $500 a week while on set. Later in her career, she earned millions of dollars through acting, singing, and brand endorsement deals. She has a net worth of $70 million. Angela Lansbury has amassed an impressive real estate portfolio over the years. She owns an apartment in New York City that lies one block south of Central Park, which she purchased in 2006 for $2 million. She also owns an extensive residence in the Brentwood neighborhood of Los Angeles. On the southeast coast of County Cork, Ireland, is the farmhouse-style retreat of Angela Lansbury and her family. The house was designed with the help of Stephen Pierce, a close friend of the actresses, whose home nearby provided the inspiration for hers. She likely owns the following cars. A Prius. A Tesla and a Kia Soul.